सो हेलो नमस्कार टू द ऑल केमिस्ट्री लवर्स डॉक्टर्स एंड इंजीनियर्स ऑफ द न्यू फ्यूचर मैं विजय कुमार सोनी आपका हार्दिक स्वागत करता हूं इन केमिस्ट्री वाला चैनल रिगार्डिंग टू योर वन एंड ऑनली केमिस्ट्री इन प्रीवियस वीडियोस वी हैव डिस्कस अबाउट द थर्ड पार्ट ऑफ द केमिकल प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ द फिनॉल एज अ सम इंपॉर्टेंट रिएक्शंस ऑफ द फिनॉल वी हैव डिस्कस अबाउट द फाइव रिएक्शन नाउ इट्स टाइम टू डिस्कस अबाउट द जस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट सिक्स रिएक्शन व्हाट इज दैट दैट इज योर रिएक्शन विद रिएक्शन विद this is the reaction with thalic anhydride thalic anhydride it's a very important reaction if we'll go with the just the reaction with the thalic anhydride then this is the structure of thalic anhydride this is the co this is the co and uh, here is the two molecule of phenol this is the h we will separate the h from para position there are two molecules of the phenol like this here will removal of s2 for the removal of s2 we will take concentrated s2so4 it's a best dehydrating agent here will formation of just your phenolphthalein like this here are the two benzene ring this is the one of the benzene ring this is the another benzene ring of the phenol this is the phenolphthalein phenolphthalein it is indicator it is used in the acid base titration by the acid base titration it uh, used in acid base titration it exists weak acidic nature weak acidic nature this was about the just the reaction with thalic anhydride now the time to discuss about the seventh important reaction that is hydrogenation reaction hydrogenation reaction it is also called as reduction reaction reduction reaction bhi kahenge particular here will formation of formation of cyclo hexanol take place cyclo hexanol how this is the phenol here i will take the presence of three of h2o in the presence of ni nickel catalyst it is too important my dear and temperature will also use as a high temperature you can say approximately 430 kelvin so here will formation of cyclohexanol these pi bond dissociates and form sig sigma bond so here will formation of cyclo hexanol it is also called as reduction reaction or as we can say that hydrogenation reaction now we time to dis discuss about the important reaction that is your seventh reaction after seven we will take just eighth reaction this is that gatterman gatterman just aldehyde synthesis ya yeah, gatterman coach aldehyde synthesis aldehyde synthesis it is also important reaction because of in this kind of the reaction it will use of we can say only just uh, this is the slip of gatterman synthesis 
that's a Gettelmann synthesis. If we'll use this carbon monoxide and HCl, then it will be Gettelmann coach LDA synthesis. This is the Gettelmann synthesis. So for this, we will use just hydrogen cyanide and HCl. This is the hydrogen cyanide. This is the HCl. It dissociate like this minus and plus electronegativity for the nitrogen is larger, carbon lesser. In that case, Cl will be over here and it will formation of amino chloride. Uh, it will be just your CH, Cl. This is the CH double bond NH. Amino chloride. Further, whenever it will react with the just phenol, then it will formation of the major, major product as a ortho isomer. This is the Cl, CH, double bond NH in the presence of AlCl3, aluminum chloride as a Levi's acid. And further, it will be use of like this. We can say you know, one of the important ortho and para, but it will major attack over the para position. So this is the OH and here is the removal of HCl. So here will formation of CH double bond NH. Further on acidified hydrolysis. This is the OH. This is the CHO. Sorry, this is the CH double bond NH. We will use of acidified hydrolysis, presence of acid like this, removal of the NS3 and here will formation of para as a major product. This is the OH and this is the CHO. This is called as para hydroxy benzaldehyde. So this was about the third important next eighth important reaction. We have discussed about the reaction with the thalic anodide, hydrogenation or you can say just reduction and Gettelmann synthesis as a formation of para hydroxy benzaldehyde. These all are the important reaction and basically helpful in the for in for the just a competition exam also. So you have to go properly with these reaction. Get them on LDH synthesis. It is too important reaction as I told you. You have to go with the each and every reaction. अगर आपने सर्कल यूज किया है यहाँ पे फर्स्ट रिएक्शन में तो भी रिएक्शन ठीक है अदरवाइज मोन भी यूज कर सकते हैं गो थ्रू प्रॉपरली नॉट द टाइम टू डिस्कस अबाउट द फर्दर We have discussed about the eighth reaction as a final. Now we will go with the ninth reaction. This is the ninth reaction. What is that? It is called as oxidation reaction also. Oxidation reaction. Dear student, this is the most important reaction because of whenever it will be given the phenol as a function group reduction in practical examination. When you have final, in practical exam, we have phenol 
आपको फंक्शन ऑफ डिटर्मिनेशन के लिए देते हैं तो हम लोग क्रिस्टेलाइन सॉलिड स्टेट में प्योर स्टेट में वो फिल करते हैं टेस्ट में वेन एवर इट विल बी जस्ट वेन एवर यू विल रीच इट विद इट जब भी आप इसके पास में पहुंचते हैं आपको पर्टिकुलर कंफर्म करना होता है आपको टेस्ट करना होता है स्टार्ट करते हैं तब तक ये लाइट पिंक कलर का चेंज हो जाता है वाई इट इज मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट सो दिस इज द फिनोल एंड वेन एवर it is in the contact of air or in the presence of cro3 both any one factor may be present so here will formation of a diketonic structure this is the diketonic structure and uh, removal of s2 this is called as para benzo quinone पैरा बेंजो क्वीनोन के कारण पर्टिकुलर का कलर लाइट पिंक कलर होता है बेटा लाइट पिंक कलर गिव्स ऑल ऑक्सीडेशन इफ विल गो विद फर्दर देन वी कैन टेक टेंथ रिएक्शन दैट इज आल्सो इंपॉर्टेंट इट इज यूज्ड टू डिटेक्ट अबाउट द कंफर्मेशन टेस्ट ऑफ द फिनोल आल्सो फिनोल के कंफर्मेटरी टेस्ट के लिए भी रिएक्शन का यूज करते हैं दिस इज द Tenth reaction and reaction with reaction with FeCl3. On reaction with FeCl3, phenol gives phenol gives violet color. Always violet color. देखा बेटा. If you are given just in a one of the test tube alcohol, another phenol. अगर आपने ऑफिशियल थ्री यूज किया न्यूट्रल देन फिनॉल गिव्स वायलेट कलर वाइल दे विल नॉट एनी काइंड ऑफ द चेंज विद द अल्कोहल सो दिस इज द सी सिक्स एच फाइव ओ एच सिक्स मॉलिक्यूल दिस इज द एफ सी एल थ्री वट विल बी हेयर विल फॉर्मेशन ऑफ अ कॉम्प्लेक्स कंपाउंड एफ ई दिस इज द ओ C six H five whole six. This is the three plus. You can say minus three minus, and rest of the just three of H plus, and rest it will be three of HCl. This is the violet colored complex compound. Violet colored. Violet. Colored, colored complex compound. That's why it gives just violet color due to formation of the you can say ferrous complex ion. This was about the confirmatory test. So we can write here. It is confirmatory test of confirmatory test of. Phenol also. So go through properly with these ten reaction. These all of are very important. If violet color is not visible, then you can see. Just a minute. Yes. Now everything is okay. So. This is the very important part of the reaction. Go through properly. Because of it is last part as a chemical property of the phenol. After then we'll go with the just your one of the important topic ether. so today we will discuss about the reaction with thalic anhydride oxidation getterman reaction a reaction with fcl3 you can say ferric phenolate is a complex ion ferric phenolate as a complex ion and reduction also has been discussed by, with you
the violet complex is ferric phenolate you can say this is the ferric phenolate ferric phenolate as a complex ion now the time to discuss about the very important part as a allowance reaction that is also important because of many of the student ask me what is the mean of bakelite because of whenever they go with the just these polymer important polymer is bakelite which is also called as phenol formaldehyde resin so it's too important to know about the structure of bakelite and reaction also so let's see this is important part and uh, don't forgive yourself means don't lose your stamina and your posture level because of chemistry is not a typical job as i told you so now i would like to go with the allowance part or uh, allowance reaction so listen me carefully this is the allowance reaction reaction with formaldehyde formaldehyde it is also called as lateral minus a reaction also it's a naming reaction lateral minus a reaction through this it will formation of formation of phenol formaldehyde phenol formaldehyde resin or you can call it just bakelite bakelite also it's a polymer if we we'll go with the reaction then this is the phenol and we have discussed during electrophilic substitution reaction this is the hcho you can write it as follows ch2o so in the presence of slight amount of acid or base you can take what will be presence of oh group is orthon para hydroxy directing reaction so here will formation of oh this is the ch2oh and uh, this is the para isomer this is the oh and this is the ch2oh ortho and para hydroxy benzyl alcohol if we take only ortho isomer what will be in the presence of again slight amount of acid or base it will remove of it will n molecule for the just ortho isomer then it will remove of n of s2 and here will formation of one of the you can say like this one of the linear polymer like this this is the structure this is the structure of the linear polymer if there is ortho isomer agar ortho isomer hi hai to particular aapke paas mein ek linear polymer ka formation hoga that is too important for us this is the oh this is the cs2 this is called as linear polymer and its name is novo lac it is used in paints particular ka paints ki form mein use karte hain and while if both are there ortho and para hydroxy like this both are there this is the ortho hydroxy benzyl alcohol 
and this is the para hydroxy benzyl alcohol then here will formation of the cross linked polymer CH2OH again in the presence of acid or base we can take mixture of ortho and ortho and para hydroxy benzyl alcohol so here will formation of a cross linked polymer like this by the removal of same ns2 because of both are condensation polymer condensation polymer first thing because of in ke formation ke dauran removal of the water molecule ka then those are known as condensation polymer small molecule alcohol ammonia water hcl ka removal second it is cross linked polymer cross linked polymer structure cross link hoga third it is called as thermo setting polymer also thermo setting polymer it is insulator in nature insulator in nature that's why it is used to form electric switches also electric switches so what will be the structure the structure is as follows cross linked polymer will not take larger structure will take only two three properly structure this is the oh here is the cross linked force of cs2 here is the structure cs2 oh here is again cs2 presence of benzene ring like this this is the oh this is the cs2 again cs2 this is another benzene ring with the oh and this is called as bakelite this is called as bakelite cross link polymer so we can call it bakelite or phenol formaldehyde resin also phenol formaldehyde resin these are the important points regarding to this reaction so go through properly with this kind of the reaction it's too important as i told you Novolac and uh, Bakelite, both of are very important. Now the time to discuss about the final reaction regarding to the phenol. This was the 11th reaction. Now we will go with the 12th reaction. It is too important for the competition exam and it is necessary. Up to particular reaction to competition exam, say phenol with a particular, but a polymer wala topic of hata diya gaya competition exam is a slee thora sa come focus karte hai bache, but knowledge ke liye or why wa ke liye. काफी और कंपटीशन एग्जाम में नो डाउट फिनोल है तो वहां इसके बारे में पूछने की प्रोबेबिलिटी बनती है सो 
Now we'll go with the twelfth reaction. It is too important, as I told you, similar to the confirmation test. जब भी आप confirmation test करें हो phenol की, तो आप इस test को आप काम में ले सकते हैं. You can explain about this kind of the reaction to your axonal. Axonal को भी आप अपना particular इस reaction के बारे में explanation कह सकते हैं. This is called as Lieberman nitroso test. Twelfth reaction. Lieberman, Lieberman, nitroso test. This is the Lieberman nitroso test. If we will go with this kind of the reaction, then आपको एक test tube मिलेगी. उसमें आप test tube में particular phenol add ले ले sample. उसमें एनएनओ टू एच सिर्फ डाल करके पर्टिकुलर स्लाइट अगर उसको हीट कर ले तो आपके पास में नाइट्रोसो डाई बनता है जो नाइट्रोसो डाई आपके पास में ग्रीन कलर का होता है उसको आपने थोड़ा सा कूल किया कूल करके उसमें पर्टिकुलर आपने कंसनट्रेटेड एस्ट्रोसो फोर ऐड किया तो वो ग्रीन से रेड में कन्वर्ट हो जाएगा फिर उसमें आपने पर्टिकुलर थोड़ा सा अमाउंट एड कर दिया एनएच का मैं इट विल चेंज इन ब्लू कलर ग्रीन से रेड रेड से ब्लू हुआ जी आर बी टेस्ट भी कहते हैं इसको पर्टिकुलर so it is also called as zrb test where z means green r means red and blue b means blue ye kuch aisa change hota hai kafi acha test hai confirmatory test of phenol confirmatory test of phenol फिनोल का कंफर्मेटिव टेस्ट होगा सो हियर इज द फिनोल बिफोर टेकिंग फिनोल इट इज नेसेसरी कि आपको नाइट्रस एसिड लैब में मिलता नहीं है सो यू हैव टू प्रिपेयर इट बाय यूजिंग दिस इज द एच दिस इज द एन एनओ टू हियर इज द फॉर्मेशन ऑफ एच एनओ टू प्लस रिमूवल ऑफ एन ए सी एल दिस इज द नाइट्रस एसिड नाइट्रस एसिड Further, whenever we will treat it with the phenol, then this is the HNO2. This is your para position. Here will removal of H2O. Formation of nitroso phenol take place. Nitroso phenol. This is the N. O nitroso nitroso phenol nitroso phenol. This is the green substance which shows a rearrangement reaction also. This is nitroso phenol O H N O two. This is the N O. and double bond o so here will sign of rearrangement reaction as a reversible reaction rearrangement reaction what will be here will removal of like this h will move here in that case the structure will be as follows double bond o and this is the n O H. This is the nitroso phenol after the rearrangement. It's a middle substance which gives green color also. वैसे तो starting यहीं से हो जाता है. Further particular, इसको treat करवाएं. Then this is the on reaction with phenol. Structure को कुछ ऐसा ले लें. This is the O. डबल बोन एन दिस इज द ओ स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ नाइट्रोसोफिनोल आफ्टर रियंजमेंट दिस इज स्ट्रक्चर एन ओ एच दिस इज अनादर मॉलिक्यूल ऑफ फिनोल वी कैन टेक एज फोलोज 
alternate double bond this is the OH what will be after removal of water here will formation of the endophenol this is the just nitrogen exists three valency that's why here will double bond by the removal of water here will formation of the endophenol dye like this this is the double bond this is the double bond and this is endophenol endophenol which gives a red color after green it will changes in you can say over here this is the nitrosophenol it's a green substance green substance as a oxime green substance as a oxime substance of phenol it's an oxime oxime ke liye n oh ka hona required hai so this is the oxime and after it cooling it changes in the presence of concentrated s2so4 removal of water endophenol and whenever we will add just NaOH NaOH then here is the H plus here is the OH minus it will removal of S2 and the salt will be as follows which gives blue color like this double bond double bond and this is the phenol structure this is the double bond and this is the o and a this is plus and minus by the removal of water this is the sodium salt you can say sodium salt of endophenol sodium salt of endo phenol which gives blue color so this was about the just final reaction first of all aapko NaNO2 or HCl add karna hai phenol mein para nitrous of phenol banega jisko thoda sa tap ke niche le jaake cool kiya to green substance ka formation hoga oxime ki formation hai after then on addition of concentrated HCl so for it will formation of the endophenol red solid PPT after addition of the small amount of one to drop of NH it will formation of the just blue substance as a sodium salt of endophenol. So this was about the Lieberman nitroso test as a green red blue test or GRB test. Go through properly and this was about the entire part of the phenol. So, dear doctors and engineers of the near future will meet in the next video with a new topic as a ether. You have to trust, you have to trust, you have to trust, you have to trust, you can share it through the WhatsApp number as a 98291-98271. Then, you will have to trust, you 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 have to trust,